but I sort of ran into an issue that I wasn't expecting at all and it was a doozy. Hello everyone! Welcome to Art Business with Ness. I'm Ness and I'm a children's book illustrator. In this video, I'm keeping you up to date with all the latest developments in the creation of my art business online course, the Art Business Bootcamp. Lots has happened since I last talked to you about this. Uh, the course has progressed really well and it also has evolved a lot. It's really getting closer and closer to a fully fledged course that's really going to be able to help you. So I'm so excited to share all the deeds and all the secrets with you. But right before we jump into the news and updates, if you too would like to make a living with your art and we'd like to see more videos like this, then make sure to subscribe to this channel and hit the little bell. The bell sends you notifications whenever I upload a new video and this way you're sure that you won't miss any of the advice. So let's get right into it. Since we last talked, a lot has progressed with the Art Business Bootcamp. I'm about halfway done with writing the script, which Yay! But I ran into a big issue that I wasn't expecting at all, and it was a doozy. Now that I, sweetie, now that I have a lot of the course written out in the script, I can see that the course is way too big. What I had planned is six modules with six lessons each, but there's just so much to cover that right now each one of those lessons is like way over an hour long. I hadn't realized just how much there is to cover until I started writing it all out. On top of the lessons being so long, the last module turned out to have 10 lessons in it instead of just the 6 like the others because there's just so much to say. It's cray cray. There are many problems with this. First of all, I'm really afraid that's gonna be way too overwhelming for the students. Imagine getting into this course and suddenly facing this mountain of information. Dozens and dozens of hours of video and like months of homework. Just thinking about it's giving me palpitations. This would take such a long time for students to go through and to complete. To give you an idea, the first module alone uh, is the portfolio modules, what I like to call my 12 piece portfolio plan. And the idea is 12 pieces in 12 weeks. So this module alone, which is only the first module, would take you three months to complete and then you'd still have five other modules after that. It's bonkers. There are other problems with this as well. Not only it would take a long time for students to go through, but it will take me a long time to make as well. So it wouldn't be available for a very long time. I have to write all of this and then film it, edit it, make all the course materials, all the bonuses. I'll be here forever doing this. And eventually I will cover all of this information in a course, but I do want you to be able to get started sooner rather than later. Also, I've started catching myself trying to cut out some information just because there's already so much. And if I can help it, I really don't want to do that. Like, I don't want to have to cut information that I know can help just because, you know, we don't have enough time. So I sat on this problem for about a week, really thinking about it hard. And I also attended a live event about course making. And I asked a lot of questions. And in the end, I think I've come up with a solution for this problem. I decided that we're going to split the Art Business Bootcamp into three separate courses. As simple as that. I'm going to call them level one, level two, and level three. Level one would be the portfolio course, which is right now module one of Art Business Bootcamp. And if everything goes well, this could be available as early as this summer. Level two would include what used to be module two, which is finding clients, and module three, which is all about contracts. So level two of our business bootcamp would cover all about really going out into the world and finding your first professional gigs. And then level three would be all about taking this to the next step and going full time. So it would include what used to be module four, which is about doing a great job and planning out your gigs so you have enough time for everything. Module five, which is all about agents and how to get one for yourself. And module six, which is about diversifying your income. So I kind of wanted to ask you, what do you think of this idea? Do you think it sounds like a great idea or no, you would really like the Art Business Bootcamp to stay into one big course? Uh, whatever your opinion on this, please go into the comments and let me know. I really want to know what you think about this because this is a course that I'm making for you. But personally, I really quite like the idea and the more I think about it, the more advantages I can see of doing it like this. 
First of all, the first part will be done very quickly so you guys can get started much earlier. And then because it's smaller separate courses, I'm splitting up the cost as well. So each part is going to be individually much less expensive than the big course. I had originally planned to offer the Art Business Bootcamp as a $997 course or it will be available for pre-order at half price, so $497. But that's still quite a huge you know, chunk of cash at one time. Whereas when it's split, the first part of the course, uh, level one, the portfolio course, would be available for only $197 or for pre-order at half price, only $97. I feel like this is a much more approachable price to get started. It's my first course, so you haven't seen me teach before and I don't have a million testimonials to reassure you either. So this way, it's not a huge commitment, it's just $97 and even if you don't like it, then you don't have to buy the future levels, you know? Another big advantage is that I can work on level 2 while you get started on level 1. Uh, like I mentioned, the portfolio course level one is going to take three months for you to complete anyway. So while you're doing that, I can already start working on the future course. And then what's really great is I now have all of this extra space so I can add all of the necessary information. I can even add more if I wanted to, more bonuses, etc. I'm already considering adding a whole new module to level one about setting up your business. So things like, you know, tracking your expenses, invoices, taxes, etc. If that's something you're interested in, let me know in the comments. Separating by levels like this would also allow me to separate the information depending on where you are in your career. Advanced tactics can be put in later levels where it makes more sense instead of doing a huge info dumps on beginners. For instance, in the current script that I have, it was really bothering me how there was so much like advanced stuff in the contract module. Since the original script for Art Business Bootcamp was divided by topics, then in the contracts module, I had no choice but to tell you everything that I know about contracts even if at that point of your career, you're only just getting started with professional work. And it really seemed a little absurd to be going over really, really advanced things like copyright licensing and royalty payouts when you're just getting started with your first, you know, small commission. Talk about overkill. Uh, those are things that myself, I learned much later down the road in my illustration career. Doing it by levels instead is gonna allow me to just cover the basics of contracts, what you need to get started with in level two, and then in level three, when you're ready to go professional full-time, then I can really give you the advanced tactics, you know, advanced negotiation and all the little clauses that you really need to be careful about in your contracts. That makes more sense to me. Another thing that's really rad with the system that I'm really excited about is that you're gonna be able to get started at the level that's most appropriate for you. Like, what if you already have a great portfolio that everyone's raving about and you don't want or need that part? Then you don't have to pay for it or waste your time with it. You can just start right at level two. I'm even thinking in the future, uh, when I have all of these different levels all made, that on my website, it would be really cool to have a little quiz uh, for people when they arrive so that you can answer a few questions about where you are and then the quiz would sort you out in the level that's most appropriate for you. This would really create a customized experience that's well tailored for your needs and where you are, not a one size fits all solution. So I'm really feeling this idea the more that I think about it, but I really want to know what you think about it. This is my first time creating a course and I really take it seriously. I want to create something that's really going to be amazing, the best I can possibly make it, something that makes sense and that's going to bring you a crap ton of value. So a couple weeks ago when I first had this idea, I ran a poll uh, both in my mailing list and also in my Facebook group, the Freelance Illustrators Cafe. By the way, if you're interested about staying in the loop about the course and everything else happening at Art Business with Ness and you'd like to participate with such polls in the future, then make sure to join the Freelance Illustrators Cafe. I'm gonna leave a link to that in the description. Right now it's really happening, there's a lot of members, everyone is having fun, so I really encourage you to join. We're at over 1,600 members right now and it's really the place to be, so don't miss out on the fun. But anyway, I ran a poll asking whether you'd like me to split Art Business Bootcamp into three 
or keep it into one big course. And this was the result. 58 to zero in favor of splitting it up. I was shocked. I did not expect it to be so one-sided, to be honest, but it really does make things a lot easier for me because it seems that you really overwhelmingly agree with me that this is a good idea. So, phew. <laughs> it really reassured me that this is the correct decision and that this is what I need to do to create the best course possible. If you haven't voted yet in the poll and you'd like to tell me what you think about all this, then don't hesitate to leave me your thoughts in the comments down below. Any and all thoughts that you have about the Art Business Bootcamp are most welcome. As I said, this is your course, so your opinion is very important to me. And if you're listening to this and you're thinking, oh my god, yes girl, this is the course for me, I need this now, and you haven't yet signed up to my mailing list, then what are you waiting for? Get on that. I will leave the link in the description, uh, really, really evident with like little star emojis and everything so you can't miss it. The waiting list is the place to be because you know I talked about uh, the pre-order where you're gonna be able to get it at half off, only $97 instead of 200. You have to be on the waiting list to get that. And if you're in the waiting list, you'll be the first one to know when the course is ready. This course is going to be amazing. And if you miss that pre-order deal, you're gonna be kicking yourself later. So don't miss out on that and hop on the list. But for right now, that's it for me today. I really hope that you enjoyed the video. And if you did, then don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to help our small channel grow. Thank you so much for being here and for watching this video. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.